Hello, my name is Sean Plenner. I'm a senior technical support analyst with Sequence Geosoft team. And thank you for taking the time to watch this bite-sized video. Did you know you could edit Geosoft Oasis montage scripts? To demonstrate this, I have two base station data and I've pre-recorded a script that will run a filter on the correction and convert the time channel from a normal number into a time channel. If I run the script, we can see the results on database one. Here's our filter channel and our time units. If I want to run this on base station day two, I cannot simply just play the processing as it was recorded on base day one and will quickly turn this back into the active database to run the program. To edit our scripts, click play, select the appropriate script and click edit. This can be done in any text editor. For this example, I'm using Notepad. When recording a Geosoft Oasis Montage script, it remembers the current database. The syntax to ignore a line is the forward slash. So first, we'd like to comment out all instances where it sets the current database. Save it. Come back into Oasis Montage. Make sure that you have the database you want to work on selected. And now you can run the process and it will run on the active database. Perhaps you find this filter is a little bit too weak and you need a stronger filter on there. Again, if you go into editing the script, you can see where the cutoff is and we can just change the number in the processing script. When we run, you can see that the filter has been applied. Thank you for watching this quick, bite-sized video on how to edit Geosoft's Oasis Montage scripts.